Nein, 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 nein. Go. Wow. I like how this dance moves nowadays. You don't need to have rhythm. You don't need to be anything. You just need to do whoa, and that's a move. Remember back in the day, you had to be flexible. You had to be rhythmic. You had to be a damn near superhero. When that song came on, ni kama club ilikuanga empty. Kila mtu. I am Ricky Nelson, and this is The Vent. So a few days ago, I put up a video, and I told you guys to go watch it before you came to watch this video. So if you have not watched it yet, please go, sorry, please pause this video right now and go to my social media and watch the video and then come back so that when you watch this, we can all be on the same page and you can have the context of this video. For those of you who already have, thank you very much. Let's get on with this. So you guys saw what happened, right? This itty bitty old girl, if I was to guess this girl is a maximum of maybe 10, maximum 12 years old. And she's all on Instagram like, oh, uh, the hell is that? That mama tore her ass up. But if you ask me, I don't think she did enough. She should have gone live with that stuff. Gone live as in set a schedule, done posters, done promos. Catch the show tonight. My daughter gonna get an ass whooping live. Because... <laughs> I'm speaking to you as the father of a little girl and for the love of God I do not know what I would do if I found my girl doing this stuff <laughs> oh there would be hell to pay in my house Wah! and this this video is based on the theories that you should not whoop your kids well, I'm gonna rephrase that and tell you, you should discipline your kids. Find what works for you and do that. A couple of weeks ago, sorry, a couple of days ago, I got into it with some people on social media about this entire story. And what I said was find what works for you and do that. But you have to discipline your kids. Your kids have to know right from wrong. So when I put up this video, someone already was there in the comment section asking, so where did they learn it from? Not my house. Uh-uh. And that's the problem with the world today. Social media affects so much of what we do. From our work lives to our personal lives, social media is everywhere. You cannot avoid it. So as parents, you have to do your best as in you have to do your freaking best if there is anything that you're gonna apply yourself to it is making sure your kids get the right exposure on the internet and the argument goes back to oh if you beat your kids they're gonna get messed up do i look messed up I, uh, my ass got whooped. I turned out great. My mother. Wow. I shouldn't be saying this stuff on video. My mother was the upper. She was in the upper class of ass whoopings. I remember this one time. Uh, she had just come home. She had had a long ass day. I don't know what happened. I was too young to understand. And we had done some dumb shit. As in, we were five boys in the house. We had done some dumb shit. And when she came home, this lady told us, Miss Piganga, 
and this woman went ahead to make us dinner and she fed us she made sure all of us were full everyone was happy and me and my brothers were like <laughs> <I'm a sow." laughs> and this woman walks out of the kitchen brandishing her favorite weapon a muiko damn stuff turned around in that house one ish <laughs> woman tandika five men five like this proper beating and you see she didn't beat us i'm not telling you guys to go and bloody brutalize your children no but you have to teach them that there are consequences to bad decisions so you know when it is put in your head that if I do dumb shit, mama going to tear this ass up. It's that simple. Because, and I'm going to say this again. Find what works for you and do that. If you don't want to whoop your kids, that's fine. But find what works for you and do that. But for the love of God, do not raise for us little shits who are going to come out in this world and start doing dumb shit and expect us to understand. Hell no. That stuff doesn't fly. So, if there is any message I've ever given you on any of my videos, this is the one you're going to take home. Find what works for you and do that but discipline your kids oh if you beat your kids they're gonna have issues screw that you're gonna have your issues but none of those issues is gonna be about not knowing right from wrong you can tell them I said it have your issues baby girl but none of them is gonna be about not knowing right from wrong the best thing about the internet and the best thing about this is this stuff is gonna be online forever so my little girl is gonna grow up and as soon as she is cognitive as soon as she can understand this stuff and that's why I'm trying not to cuss too much in this video I'm gonna play this for her just so that she can know that if she try any dumb shit I learned from the best. I am Ricky Nelson, and this is the vent. <laughs>